guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a review on my not, my part two to my skincare routine, and it's going to be on Bliss products. So, if you're ready for me to jump into this, then keep watching. I'm going to use toner, and this is the Bliss What a Melon Replenishing Watermelon Toner. This is what it looks like. So, these are like $9.99, almost like $10 per these kind of products. And all these products are um, vegan and 100% cruelty free. I had to say that slowly. Oh, is that supposed to come off? <laughs> Did I break it right? <laughs> oh, what? Alex. <laughs> I can't even. I'm sorry. Wrong. Oh. I know, I can't even like. Is this. I did watermelon replenishing watermelon toner and this has witch hazel, willow bark, and hydrolonic acid. Alcohol free. Try saying that again. So I'm going to use this to start off my face and to clean it from all the dirt that's been on my face from walking or running or any kind of exercise. So you open it like this and you just squeeze it like that. It doesn't have really any particular smell. It's this smells really clean. It kind of smells good. Um, it smells good. Oh, I hit my nose. Do you think? It kind of smells like, I mean, honestly, though, it smells really good. It kind of smells like watermelon. So, I mean, if you love that smell, you should totally try it. And you can see the dirt off my face a little bit. You see that right? I'll probably know this video too. My lovely boyfriend's recording this so he can give his honest opinion if it looks okay. That's a lot of dirt. That's gross. You didn't say that again. They gotta do the hydrating eye gel to depuff and brighten. Duh. Coin roller ball. It's cruelty free. Free from parents and ooh, look at this. I do all things. Hydrating eye gel and to deep puff and brighten. Cool. This is cute. You see how cute this is? Super cute. Yes, I'm wearing my lovely robe. Don't judge me. Ooh. So we're just gonna put like a little <laughs> look how cool that is. Yeah, see that? Do you see that? Yeah. We're gonna cut out a lot of this. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know why I started off with this. I could have done this last, I feel like. It's good. Like, as I say, you're not supposed to use but the third finger, the ring finger. Has less pressure and prevents wrinkles. Thank you. It feels kind of cooling. That's what I think about this. This is a good product. So then we have the Micro Magic Skin Renewing mic uh, Microdermabrasion Scrub. Yeah. So you gently massage onto clean, damp skin for one to two minutes and rinse well and use two to three times a week. So I'm going to put this on my skin and we'll wet my face. We'll go ahead and just put my roof on it. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and I think I need to open this. Oh, this feels weird. It is a scrub. That's why it says gently massaged. So here's my face. Oh, that hurts. Guys, this does not feel good on your skin. That's a scrub, that's what's supposed to. This does not feel good. It says gently massage, and I'm like, this does not feel good. I don't know if I like this product. It looks like it hurt. It kind of hurts. That's rough. <sighs> it feels rough. That's what it feels like. I mean, it's supposed to be like that, I guess. But I like the other products. I mean, this one, okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this on my skin for one or two minutes, and we'll be right back. One hour later. All right, guys, so I went ahead and I already rinsed it off, and this is what it feels. It feels kind of rough, and my skin feels kind of like red. It looks really irritated, so I kind of don't like this product. And if you have sensitive skin 
and your skin gets red and if you also have dry skin I wouldn't recommend using this it says use two to three times a week but maybe once a week my face I don't think this is for me so <laughs> I don't really recommend this, and I like a lot of Bliss products so far, so this is one I don't like. So, yeah, let's jump in this one. So, this is my favorite so far, and this is the Bliss Fab Foaming 2-in-1 and Exfoliator with Bamboo Buffers. And it smells so good. Ooh. My nose, but it smells so good. I always use this in the shower because I like to clean my face in the shower because that's how I am. Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna dampen this. Wash off. Should have done that first place. And I'm just gonna like dampen my face again. Oh, my face is so red. I am. Do you see how red my face is, Ryan? No? Does it not look red to you? Everybody, please comment. Your cheeks are red. Face. Because the scrub really hurt, uh, hurt my skin. Guys, I'm gonna be so difficult. I'm gonna do it. This is the way I do it, even though this is not the right way. You're a monster! Ryan, judge me. This feels so good, too. I love the bamboo smell that's on here. Oh my god, amazing. Okay, guys. So it's like really nice and foamy. It feels so good, y'all. Oh my gosh. <sighs> it's so calming to do this. But I love this. Plus, when you do this in the shower, you can like be washing your face and then stop for a minute and just, you know, shave your legs and let your face get itself all together. And there you go. So this is supposed to stay on my faces. This is an oil-free gel cleanser, brimming with bamboo buffers and vegetable derived cleansing agents provides a gentle exfoliation while removing makeup and grime from, for smoother, more radiant skin, plus flower, uh, botanical soothe and refreshing scent invigorates for the win. Use daily on wet skin, lather up and rinse. So, we're only gonna use this for a couple of, like maybe just a minute, and then I'm just gonna take it off. I'm gonna dance through my hands and get them all nice and like, you know. Wait, and I'm gonna go back in and lather my face again. Cause it's got these little exfoliators. And I don't think this is gonna make my face as red cause I've already used it before, but. Guys, I just need Hiram to just, you know, rate my skincare routine. Is it good enough, Hiram? Is it? Please. I just want Hiram to roast me on my skin or anything. That's all I want. So. Oh, I feel so good wearing it off. Now we have a I just dropped something. Okay. And I'm gonna pat my face dry. So I think we're done with the cleansing part. And then I'm gonna do the <laughs> um, Let's see. Next, we're going to do. There's two different moisturizers. So on one side, I'm gonna do um, the Drench and Quench Cream to Water Hydrator for all skin types. So my skin's really dry right now, so I'm gonna use this for hydration. Free from parabens, silicates, SLS. L -S -L -S -L -S -S -L -S S-L-E-S and more. It's, you know, cruelty free. Yeah. And the next side will be Bright Idea Vitamin C Tripeptide Collagen Protecting and Brightening Moisturizer. So this is what they look like. And these are really, this one's really great. It's very lightweight, like it says. It's very moisturizing. It's not too heavy. And it feels really good on the skin. It feels very natural. And it feels like it does something with my skin. And it really does help with my breakouts, considering I wear a mask all the time and the face just breaks out like crazy. So, this is what the sweat looks like. And it's really cool. So, you massage on a clean skin for 30 seconds for instant hydration for the morning and at night. So, this is what I use at night since it's my nighttime skincare and morning time. Even though I'm wearing a shirt under this, but... 
That's what it looks like, and I love it. So we're just gonna use a little bit because we are doing one side to try out both sides. So I'm just gonna do like this side, this side. Okay. This side of my nose. And we're gonna rub it down on my chin and on my neck. The chin and neck, you know. And then I'm going to close it. This is really good, just so you guys know. And then we're going to try out the bright idea of vitamin C tripeptide collagen protecting brightening moisturizer. So, happy plump day. So, yeah, I'm going to try this on my right side. Yeah. This is what this looks like. I seen another YouTuber use this, that's why I thought I would try it. Emma Chamberlain uses this, so she inspired me. There's really no smell, but the other one does smell like bamboo, like it does the cleanser. Since it smells like bamboo, it does smell a lot, you know, better, I feel like. This is a great cleanser, like a great cleanser. This is a great moisturizer, and it's not really, just, it doesn't really have any smell, but it does feel good on my skin, or I feel like it would. Oh yeah, it feels really creamy, and it's for hydrating. Do you hear anything? Yeah. But I'm gonna put this on this side of the nose, on this bridge of the nose. And I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna get off the applicator. I'm disgusting. This feels more like creamy. So the last one felt more like hydrating, but it had a different texture, and this one feels more creamy. So it just it all depends on what you think. This looks really good. It's for collagen. It's collagen protectant, so it's good for the skin, it's good for the face. I'm gonna put it all the way down my neck for, you know. Well, which one feels better? Which one feels better? Do you see a major difference, Ryan? Do you think they, this side look better than that side? You can comment, talk out loud. They don't like to know who you <laughs> Just tell me. For me, it looks. I still look red. I feel red because it looks the same to me. To me, they look the same, but like, do you see I... any like my pores are emphasizing or anything? I don't know. We won't know. I am half time. blind. You are asking the wrong person. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Anyways, these products seem really good. Twenty dollars. Forty dollars, guys. Twenty dollars a piece. Twenty, almost twenty-two dollars a piece. To me, that's expensive. But you know. They are what they say they are. They are good products and they are vegan and cold juice free. So I do have to give them credit. So this has to be a really good brand. Bliss is really on top of it. So yes, I love their products and I can't wait to try more products. But And the final last one that we're going to get into is the Bliss Bright Idea Vitamin C Tripeptide Collagen Protecting and Brightening Serum. So this is what it looks like. And this is what you use, the last thing you use for you, I think, my bed. Bright Idea. I love how orange and bright this is. It's super cute. My poor face has been through so much. Oh, there you go. Just put a little bit, and then we're gonna put it all over the skin. This is what you use last in your skincare routine. And then we're just gonna rub it in. This is good for my skin. And I'm trying to see if there's anything else I need to say about this. Massage on a clean skin, dry skin, morning and night. Can be used for, with Bright Idea, moisturizer and eye cream. Layers perfectly under moisturizer and makeup avoid eye area, keeping cool, dry place up. So, yeah. so yeah, you can use this with any of these um, products after you put this on. It goes right under your skin, uh, right under your, this, you know, routine. But, but yeah, guys, this has been my nighttime skincare with Bliss and I do recommend a lot of these products, I actually like these, and I actually have been trying some of these products, especially these two. I started, I bought them off to try them before I made this video, just so I can give my honest opinion. I wish this was sponsored, but obviously it's not sponsored, but I am giving my honest opinion for these two, and I definitely love these products. Um, the only one I could say I really don't like is the Micro Magic um, Scrub, because this scrub um, can irritate my skin, and if you have really dry, sensitive, or rosacea on your skin like i don't think you should try this so this is like a no for me so no but yes thank you guys for watching this video please don't forget to give this a thumbs up and please subscribe and comment down below on what video you like to see next thank you guys i love you bye